I bought an Amcor portable AC model AF1100E. IT just does not seem to be cooling my room. The room is 25 by 10 and I have had the machine running full time for 24 hours. It shows that the room temp is 88 and it has gone back and forth from 92 to 87. I have a small window unit that cools off my bedroom in a matter of minutes so I don't understand why this one which is supposedly a better choice than a window unit will not cool my room. Any ideas? Welcome to Just Answer. Buy a cheap thermometer and let it sit in the room for half an hour then read it. Notice the read exactly. Then put it in the cold air discharge of the Amcor unit and tell me if the air is any cooler, the air should be between 15 and 20 degrees Fahrenheit cooler than the room air. If the air is only 6 or 8 degrees Fahrenheit cooler, then the unit has a refrigerant leak and is low on refrigerant. If the air is same temperature as the room, then the compressor is not running or the unit is totally out of refrigerant if the compressor is running. Let me know what you find, we can go from there. Phil Hi Phil I really don't have the time to run out and buy something extra. I work from home which is why it is important that I can cool off. I have no idea what you are referring to when you say the cold air discharge. Does this model take refrigerant? I saw nowhere in the manual about Freon or any other type like that. Does it take water and if so, where would that go? Is there anything I can check without buying something extra? If so, can you tell me how to and where to check? Hello again, by the term cold air discharge. I mean the place where the cold air blows out of the unit. All air conditioners have refrigerant in them. They only need refrigerant added if they develop a refrigerant leak, then the leak must be repaired and refrigerant must be added. They do not use refrigerant otherwise? The manual is for homeowners. It does not discuss refrigerant issues. It does not take water. It does remove water vapor from the air however and blows it out the back with the hot air discharge to the outside. The only thing the homeowner can check in a case like this is its performance. That's done by checking how cold the air is that comes out of the unit and blows into the room, I can tell a lot about the unit from that. If no air is blowing out at all, the cooling coil may be covered with ice dot that happens sometimes if you let a unit run all night. So I need to know if blowing much air, and how cool or not cool the air is. Sorry but there is no other option when it comes to diagnosing the problem online. Amcor units have a bit of a checkered past, they are made in China, many appliance shops refuse to work on them. And of those that do, you can end up paying more in repairs than it costs to buy a new unit. Stay in touch, let me know what you would like to do, I can opt out and you can talk to another of our experts who might want to take this question up for you. Or you can get me some data on how the unit performs and I get you a diagnosis from that. Phil Phil 41515.9666213542 Thanks Phil. Sorry to sound so ignorant and just so disappointed and now feeling I've been ripped off. Anyway, I will try and get out to buy the thermometer. If it helps in the meantime, the window unit I have in the bedroom is about 10 years old and it cools my 12 by 10 bedroom in about 5 minutes. When I put my hand in front of the place where the air comes out, 
my hand is actually cold. On the Ampore unit when I do the same it's nowhere near the same coldness. It's cool but by no means cold. I have it running now for 24 hours and the room temp on it is 88, Argaga. Phil I am going to run out now and get the thermometer so I will be right back to test your suggestion okay? Hello again, thanks for the feedback. So far it sounds like a refrigerant leak or that the compressor is bad or the electronic controls have the compressor shut off. I will know a lot more when I get the temperature reads. Phil. Okay and back and set the thermometer in the center of the room. Talk to you in 30 minutes smile. Okay, I will be here Phil. Phil how close to the air vent do you want me to hold it and for how long? It won't fit into the air vents. Hello again, hold the thermometer as close to the air vent as possible, pressed up next to it. You can tape it in place, leave it there for 5 or 6 minutes. Listen to the unit running the entire time, tell me if you the compressor stopping and starting in that time frame or tell me if the sound does not change at all. Click here for some reviews on Amcor Phil Phil 41516.0684527778. Hi Phil OK it was 91 degrees in the middle of the room and I taped it to the air vents for 5 minutes and now it reads a freezing drop to 88 degrees. Hello again, if those reads are accurate it means that the compressor is running, and that it either has a refrigerant leak, and needs that fixed and the unit recharged, $300 to $400. Or the compressor is bad and needs to be replaced, $450 to $600, either of those repairs will cost more than you can buy a new unit for. Most shops will not work on them for that reason, and because getting parts for the Amcor units is often difficult or next to impossible. The Amana window units are a good alternative, those carry good warranties, and are generally considered repairable. Let me know if you want to check into the unit further to see if the compressor is actually running, if it is it will be hot on top. You can also remove the plastic panels from the unit, it's not altogether easy, and feel the tubes connected to the compressor, the smallest one will be hot, if the compressor is actually running. If you wish to rate my advice so far positively, I will appreciate it and hold the question open without time limit as we discuss your range of options. Thanks. Phil. In your professional opinion, what do you think I should do? I bought on Craigslist for 150.00. Ask for my money back? Hello again, if it's new, from a retailer, you should be able to return it and get your money back. If it's used, from a private party there is chance the person will refund your money, especially if you mention small claims court as an option. $50 to $150 is a typical price for a used air conditioner in that size range. If his ad says he guarantees it to work then you might have a good case in small claims court. Typically those selling defective merchandise were their ads to avoid such liabilities though. You may have to just bite the bullet and buy a new one, I like the Amana units. They have good warranties and parts are always available. Stay in touch as necessary. Phil. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.